So, time for the first Moore's Millions qualifier of the season then. I'll explain what they're all about halfway through the race, and we get a bit of time, we'll have a look at the card first of all. Three mile, five furlongs this time. All guns firing for Vinnie Gerard is a top one. Hardy Accord, James Shea. Heart paces for Hems. I do, I do, I do for Graham Clutterbuck. Knickerbocker Glory for Joshua Sutherland. All mellow ounces for Martin Eden. Palacci for Ryan Costello. Slow burner, Leon Van Rensburg. Watergate, Darren Thompson. Whenever Dragoon, Alex Cherry. Byler West, John Morgan. Bayswater, Marsh, Dave. We'll add Fifi for Paul Rhodes, Fiddler's Woman's for Derek Hinton, Maritza T. Rogers, Merrill's Golly for Daniel French, and Roach for Paul O'Neill. So 17 of them being called in as we get an aerial sweep of the track. There we go, ready to go. And off we go. In this first Moore's Millions qualifier of the season, there will be one or two of these every week for about the first 10 or 11 weeks of the season. And then at the end of the season, there's a, right, two finals which are run over the Grand National Course in the final week of the season. And to qualify as they come down to the first of the 23, then. And we've lost one already. All Mellow Ounces is gone. So All Mellow Ounces unships the pilot at the very first fence. And I think it's the first three. It might be the first four that qualify through to the final. There's two every week. There's normally one around about three mile five. And there's normally one as they take the second one about four miles plus the final of the long distance one is run over the exact same course as the Grand National um, and the shorter one is about three mile five I think so over that one they go so you get your horses in these and you qualify for the final big race at the end of the season it's always a good bit of fun so it's all guns firing then in the lead on Bailer West on the outside in second and Watergate in third and the race is named after chap who used to be involved in a league years ago as a bit of a memorial to him so that's where the names come from if anybody's interested in knowing about that as they come down to the fourth they're all safety over that one Paul Moore's his name was I think he was a pretty big player in the league and um, sadly died a few years ago and this race is run every every week and then the final in his honour every year so down towards the next we go then and all guns fire and by the west in front, Watergate is third as they skip over the fifth. And just lost the one so far then. All mellow ounces. And with that next one they go. Bit of a mistake there by Maritza. It's all guns far and has got the lead. By the West is second. And Watergate is third as they come down towards the next. It's the seventh already. And we've lost someone else there. The grey's gone there. Hardy Accord. So that's one of the four greys out of the race now that's either James Shea or Hems as we're going to do a little bit of camera work as we pass the winning post two more circuits to go and all guns foreign racing away from the stand in the lead and all guns foreign is in from Bayula West in second Watergate is third and then whenever Dragoon is four Heart Paces is five and Fiddler's Woman is six and then Nickerbock and Glory and Slow Burner and Fifi after that then Maritza and Merrill's Golly with Roach Perlachi after that one, and as they take the next, oh, I do, I do, I do, is towards the back, and he was, he's now last because Bayswater Marsh has got rid of the jockey at that one, so three out now then, as they race down towards the next, with all guns firing, leading by a length to Byler West in second, whenever Dragoon is third, and Watergate is fourth, a gap of a length or so, back to the rest of them, who are headed by Fiddler's Woman's, on the inside of Heart Paces as they take number nine. All over that one, okay, with the loose horses running around for fun at the back. And all guns firing lead is now up to about two. To Byler West in second, whenever Dragoon being driven up on the inside in third. We see them over that plain one. And all over that one, okay, with Palachi, just the back marker. So it's all guns firing in the green in the lead still. Byler West and John Morgan Blue in second as they take this big ditch. And see them over that one. Mistake towards the back there by Merrill's Golly. See that one drop to almost last. They're inside the final two miles now. And the leading three are probably three or four lengths clear of the little second group. And there's a gap of about a length to the final groups. They're almost in three little groups in, aren't they? With all guns firing by the West and whenever Dragoon in the leading group taking that one the second two groups are now merging into one but all guns firing whenever Dragoon and Byler West are putting the pace to the race and those John Morgan horses up there so they can't afford to let that one get too far in front but the field is 
reasonably tightly packed, especially when you consider a couple of the hurdle races we've had already today. Well, the field got well strung up. We've lost another one there. Watergate's gone. So Watergate, a crashing fall. A jockey was about 12 foot ahead of the horse. So spectacular looking fall there. And over the next one they go. And all guns far and by the west with Winnabar Dragoon. They come down to the 15th. And they come up past the Stalas. Another one gone there. That's Roach this time. Roach has gone. On. So, you're getting some fallers in this. And they're going to come past the post. Well, another circuit to go. And all guns far is in front. Bylo West is second. Whenever Dragoon is third, they've now been joined by Knickerbocker Glory and Slow Burner. Heart Paces has been. It's just tagging onto the back of that little group as well. Then there's a gap back to Fiddler's Woman, Fifi and Maritza were together. And then Merrill's Golly, I do, I do, I do. And a big gap back to Palachi, who's just been hampered by a couple of loose horses as they take that plain one. Uh, all over that one, OK. But Byla West has now just poked his head in front. So Byla West is just in the lead. From Organs firing in second. Whenever Dragoon is third, Knickerbocker Glory is fourth, and then Heart Base is in slow burner. Gap them back to Fifi, Maritza, and Fiddler's Woman's together. I do, I do, I do, and Meryl's Golly behind that. And Palachi is somewhere adrift. They come down towards the 17th, then, and over that one, Organs firing. Now, they again, mistake in the back of the pack there by Fifi. And Organs firing has regained the lead. Knickerbocker Glory going well on the outside. Whenever Dragoon is still there. And Heart Paces and Slow Burner. Oh, a crashing fall there for Heart Paces. That one's gone there. A real bad fall it is. And crashing falls in this race. Well, normally these long distance chases are the better jumpers. They take this ditch next. And another one's gone. Another one down there. It's Maritza this time. So we've lost, what is that, eight now? Well, seven, seven gone. So we know all that's been happening. Byler West has taken it up. And Slow Burner has moved into second. Knickerbocker Glory is now third. Then whenever Dragoon, all guns firing. Looks like he's run his race. He's now dropping through the pack. Fifi is trying to run on. Then Merrill's Golly and I do, I do, I do. And Fiddler's Woman's Palachi is still there somewhere as they take the 20th. And over that one, a mistake at the back by Fiddler's Woman's and a slow jump by whenever Dragoon. But it's now Slow Burner and Byler West with... Knickerbocker Glory back in third. He's probably between these front three now and as they come down towards the third from home. And Slow Burner is about half a length clear of Byler West in second. This is the third last. Better jump by Byler West and Knickerbocker Glory on the outside. Also running off from the back now is I do, I do, I do. But it's Byla West in the lead, coming down towards the second last. Byla West gets over it in front. Mistake there by Slow Burner. Surely cost that one his chance. It's Byla West now beginning to pull away. Knickerbocker Glory, what's it got left? Coming down towards the final fence. It'll all be down to the jump. Byla West stood off it, got over it well, but now Slow Burner jumps in really well this time and tries to throw down a challenge again. But Byla West has got enough in the tank and racing up towards one. Byla West is going to take this one. It's going to be close for second. Slow Burner and Knickerbocker Glory then back in fourth. He's going to be, I do, I do, I do. A blanket finish for fifth. Probably just Fifi or maybe even Fiddler's Woman towards the back. Palachi is going to get round. And Boiler West takes it. Oh, a good four lengths in the end. Slow burner. Chance went with that second last mistake, I think. He did jump the last wheel, though. Action pack race thrills and spills. Fallers galore. And Bile OS takes it for John Morgan, Slow Burner, Leon Van Rensburg second, Knickerbocker Glory, Joshua Sutherland third, I do, I do, I do for Graham Cresswell was fourth, and Fiddler's Woman's for Derek Hinton was fifth.